Peaceful protesters don't need to have snipers and tanks hounding their ass. Tell, tell me why, bro. Because the First Amendment protects all Americans in their freedom of expression and freedom of assembly. You served your country? I did. I was a U.S. Marine in Iraq. So, you're telling me that as a Marine, you're telling me your professional opinion is that they don't need snipers and Iraq trucks to, uh, to stop these protesters? When it's a peaceful protester, that is clearly excessive and a violation of every single protester's constitutional rights. What does it make you think you go out there and you fight for your country in these foreign uh, occupations, and now you come home and you have these measures turned against you? I go protect Iraqis in Iraq, and I come back and I find that my fellow Americans are being attacked by police. Thank you, sir. Yeah, you guys are dead on. Okay, we got a runner in a white shirt running along that wall. That wall where the flag walker was. He's he's stopping. Now he's running. He's taking cover. You got more coming. Jesus Christ, it's like a fucking turkey shoot. Now, it looks like to me this guy is aiming a gun right at the area where Joe Biggs is at. Look at this guy. And look at this guy too. Look, let's follow the, uh, the line of sight here. And this is what they do. As you can see, they are moving in numbers and starting to forcefully push people back. Hey Joe, why don't you tell these guys one of your military stories? <laughs> I'm on, you want to get, this is the sidewalk. I'm on the sidewalk. I'm on the sidewalk. And like I said, inch by inch, this is how you take your rights. First, you can protest in the daytime. Now you can't protest in the daytime. Then you can protest on the sidewalk. Now you can't protest on the sidewalk. Now you can protest over here. Now you can't stand over here. Now you gotta walk all the way down the street. Can I go back that way? Okay, so they're telling me I can't go back that way. All right. I mean, for how long? When is the street gonna be open? I mean, when's it gonna, I mean, it's gonna be open tomorrow or what? Then why are you? You know what? What's your name, sir? I'll be happy to move. Tell me your name. Sir, sir, I'll be happy to leave. Just tell me your name. Just tell me your name, sir. Okay, so this officer is refusing to tell me his name. I told him I'd be happy to comply, but he won't tell me his name. And that's the kind of accountability that you get in Police State USA. Now, Joe Biggs, this officer just ordered me to move. I was going to be arrested. I said, officer, I'll be happy to move if you only tell me your name. And now they won't tell me, your, tell me my name or tell me his name. My car's over there. My car's over there. All right, hands up, don't shoot. All right, I'm going that way. All right. Thank you, sir, for having a cool head. This guy's pushing me. Take your hands off me, sir. Take your hands off me, sir. I'll be happy to move. See, why you guys keep talking? I'm walking this way. Walk in front of the police officer. Hey. Hey, hands up, don't shoot. Watch up. All right. Everybody's cool. All right. So this is what happens. I'm looking at these feet, man. I'm moving right now. Golly. So you see how these guys keep bullying you? This is how they just keep doing. And once again, I understand that not every cop is bad. Not every cop endorses this type of behavior. But you saw these guys are putting their hands on me. They're pushing me around. They got heavy armor. I'm not even armed. And this is how they do. It must be. Hey, a guy's aiming a gun at me. Must continue in a peaceful I don't know if the guy's aiming a gun at me, but it definitely looks like he's uh, pretty close there. Fair to comply may result in arrest. Look at, all, look at the peaceful protesters. 
the majority of which are on the sidewalk. You got a few guys standing in the streets, just barely in the streets. Now we're back at the exact same spot. We yeah. Yeah. Tough guys. Very tough guys. Injury. Unintended persons. Do not throw items of any kind. Nobody's throwing anything. Exactly. Look at the guy, look at him. We got a good shot of him today. Can you stop aiming that thing, bro? We got a group of three, they're all running now. Well, we got lots of. See the guy in white? He's going too fast, now they're hauling ass. We got that. Got a big group coming. Yep, on the wall. Squeezing off. Go, Burke, this is Doc. I'm on building two. Good. Wow, you got a whole group of them. We got a bunch of bad guys at 12 o'clock, 800 meters from building two. We've got about 15 of them on the run.
Now notice, they want to talk about the riders and the looters and they're popping us up. Oh my God, man. That, man, that's, don't do all that. Don't burn down your own freaking neighborhood. They pop a smoke over here. Bro, no, quit. Bro, bro, quit. Stop, stop. Bro, quit. Man. Why you gonna burn down somebody else's house? What is that? Okay, on Sketch Kari Jackson, InfoWars.com. This will likely be my last broadcast of the night. The phone's about to die, and they're shooting stuff at us. Shlach <laughs> Malabiskum! got shot with a rubber bullet. Now I'm running down the street. Man, quit shooting at me. Quit shooting at me. You see they shooting at us. Infowars.com. <laughs> 